Jealousy is a song about dealing with someone with depression and knowing that you can't fix them, you just have to love them and you just have to be there for them, uh, even if it means being there in the darkness with them until they come out the other side. This was a really important song that I was kind of conceptually working on for quite a while and I knew I needed to write it. And so one day I kind of came up with these harp riffs that I thought worked pretty well for this concept and then I was jamming out some vocals over them and so I came up with the lines lead me and leave me and then <laughs> this is how my brain works. I was like, right, I need a third line that rhymes with those. And if you go, if you leave me, then I'll go where you lead me, if you go. And my brain was like, well, obviously you're a Dietschy. You're a Dietschy. <laughs> Which is uh, Gluck's pronunciation in, in his opera, Orpheus in the Underworld. So that kind of stuck and actually, conceptually, it was perfect. Uh, it was a beautiful moment of serendipity because, as you may know, Orpheus, firstly, is a musician. He's the son of a muse and in Gluck's opera, he's actually a violinist. But also in a lot of paintings and versions, he's actually depicted playing a harp. The story of Orpheus and Eurydice is quite a tragic one. She's his wife and he loses her and goes to the underworld to rescue her. Hades lets him, but on one condition, that he walks in front of her and he doesn't look back no matter what. Sadly, in a moment of anxiety, he looks back and then she's lost to him forever. As you can see, it's quite relevant to the concept of the song and actually it became the focal point for the album. I've been writing a fairy story to accompany it and in my story also, um, the princess goes to rescue her lover from the underworld and it also um, comes to a tragic end. See your body shaking Lie beside you Watch the hell inside you And I can see the way your 